So today I'm gonna do some gardening. So this is how it looks like right now. We just added this, um, I forgot the name of this tree. And I'll add something here to make it look more pretty. Alright, I'm excited. So let's start. <clears throat> What's today? October And then that's Becca She's playing, right? Saturday <laughs> She looks so happy because I just organized her playpen She got new mat! Hi, bagong mat langga! Hi, say welcome to the vlog! Say hello! Bye-bye! We got a new dog Apparently, that is Marley, and my husband is just sitting down, chilling, watching her his game. So I'm about to cook some Mexican food. So one of my favorite Mexican foods is timole. So I'm gonna use this sauce and some chicken. So before we start, I'm gonna get my caffeine. So we do observe the Sabbath. So we can't really buy yet. I don't have rice to cook the tomato rice. So for today's or for today's dinner's menu, magloto dal, Mexican food. So I have here some chicken. Then we will just fry this over here. Ako na niyong gihugas ano? So I don't like to put oil. So. Oh my god. <laughs> I like to put oil. Okay, I wanna use the skin for flavor. We'll use the natural oil of the chicken. They have really big ties. In the Philippines, no, this is super small. Okay. So I'll just have to um let it fry and then the fat will reduce. And then we can start chopping our vegetables or I mean the spices. But first, coffee break. Mm. Yeah. Na siya. So I don't really make food, Mexican food, all the time. So I'm a little bit blatty with my husband because um. <clears throat> I know that he misses it a lot, but because we're in Texas, he has a way to get it somehow, like always. So at home, I always make Filipino food, and especially here in San Antonio, Filipino food is super expensive, and also stuff is super expensive as well. So I try to make Filipino food almost every day. Mm, the rice, not so often anymore because it's mahal. Papi is trying to play with Becca. Hi, Becca! Hi, Marley! This is Marley. We adopted the dog just literally yesterday. Last night. Last night from also from a Filipino family that was trying to move to the other state. And then our little dog died. Um, Brandy. So, it's a blessing that you know, we got Morley. Hi! And it's the same color. Becca! Good talk. <laughs> I'm sorry. Becca, what are you going to do? You should have gave the story of her. Like, it's going to be a separate vlog, baby. Yeah. So, how we vlog. Yeah. Hey, more content. So Becca loves reading books and doing puzzles. No? Ginan ka mga dua no? Basa basa no? Unsa man na? Becca. Unsa man na? 
So if possible, I always speak Visaya to Becca so she can have three languages. Her papi speaks to her in Spanish and then he us we speak English. <laughs> so I don't know. She's having a hard time. So let's go back to our food. Okay, that's going. Can you see that? It's a lot of oil. So that's why I don't add oil anymore. <laughs> so. and half of this white onion it cooks I just wanted to like saute with the chicken so for all the Hispanics out there do not judge me this is like I've made mole like maybe five times in my life maybe this is the fifth time <laughs> so I don't know the actual recipe I just I think I followed my mother-in-law's but I do believe hers is way better than mine so yeah but my husband said that my molly tastes good actually the first few times that I made it for this I like to match it with that <laughs> so as you can see there, I have already added the other ingredients. Looking good. Turn up the heat a little bit more. It's been a while since I've eaten more. I think. The holidays was the last time. It's also a popular dish. Uh, I like the actual mole that's like made from scratch. Um, this one I just bought like a pre-made, uh, a store-bought sauce, but it's really good. This brand that I'm gonna be using, it's a uh, Doña Maria brand. See. Yeah, my mother in law actually uses this one, so and so far I like it, I love the taste of it. Yeah. So we just really wait till um, this caramelizes, especially the onions. So, if you notice, guys, I don't really like saute first with um, onions and garlic and onions. Because I don't like the burnt taste. So I heat up the meat first and then I add garlic and onion. So while that's cooking, just a little bit of story time. Um, we just recently moved here. Not really recent, but we moved here in San Antonio, Texas. My husband is really from Texas and Austin. But um, he found a job here in San Antonio, so that's why we moved here. He separated from the military if you've been watching my vlogs before you would know that you know i'm that girl who made about how to survive military life and how we made it how we did ldr so that was my videos most of, um, when i was starting out back in 2017 and then um i did travel vlogs i haven't vlogged in a long time especially when i gave birth to my daughter or when i got pregnant i just focused more on um just being pregnant enjoying the whole journey so now we're back at it i feel like this is gonna be it i'm gonna add the water now so it could simmer and we will put the or we will boil it for like an hour and a half or an hour until it's tender so there's my water, 
How do I possibly know this? Wait, because my hands are super, super wet. Ah, okay, there you go. Can I make it? All right. So I like a bunch of soup. Because the sauce is just so good with the rice. So I'll cover this and let it simmer for an hour and a half. And uh, I'm going to try walking Mar Marley. Mm -hmm. Wait. She's, Giselle has to be the one to go first. Teaching her to not be crazy. Turn off these lights. There you go. See? Good job. She's heavy, but she'll stay with you, though, if you control her like that. You're doing good. Hold on. Let me lock the door. Yeah, let me lock the door real quick. Let me go ahead and grab my. Hey, Jaeger, how you doing, boy? All right. So after like an hour and a half, look at that. It should be super tender now. So we're gonna add the mole soup. So since the mole soup is a little bit spicy, I separated like a you know one piece for Becca and some soup, and it looks really good right now. So here's our mix. Doña Maria Mole, it's a chocolate sauce. Can you believe it, guys? It has some chili, it's a chocolate chili sauce. The first time I tried it, I thought it was a little weird. I mean, the first time I heard about it, but when I tried it, I was so amazed because it was so good. A portion of it. It's super chocolatey. Look at that. Like really thick sauce. And it's gonna get yeah. up there. Doing this, just melting it. I've already seasoned this with some pepper and chicken bouillon. So after a few mixes, look at this. Super thick. Oh, this is the type of consistency that you're trying to get when making mole. And healthier version or option, quinoa rice. It's still gonna taste good because this is good. Let's see. And let's do the taste test. The sauce. Mm. Mm -hmm. That is rich and thick. Mm. We're ready to eat. One of his um, favorite food. So. Mm. Mole. Mm. We're about, about to eat too. Just had it with my quinoa rice, and then Becca will have just the mole. Hi! So we are in the diner. Like in the movies so it's an old diner and they serve all-time american food and there's also some what do you call this um mexican food as well right some food. yes you like it in here becca she's hungry mm -hmm, that's good that's cool so you know how in the movies, guys, like you always see the diners, like the actors and actresses? 
we are in a booth, the same booth. And then over there, they also have like the bar area so you can eat your breakfast. So they serve breakfast all day and lunch and dinner. And it's called Jim's Restaurant here in San Antonio in WW White Road Drive. So let's see if the food is good. our thrift shopping today and we found a lot of cool stuff which I will show you later but for now dinner time where do we eat dinner uh in and out yay we to go in and out Becca yeah so we will show you guys let's go we are right here at in and out and we're about to go on a Monday <laughs> I thought we we're trying to lose weight. Monday. I thought we we're trying to lose weight. Right, so we're going in and we're about to order. Thank you. Thank you. I'm gonna order. I'll get a double double. Hi, how are you? Onion, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yes. Wow. <laughs> Say thank you. And our order is here. So I got the cheesy fries and we got the double double. Someone wants to eat already. And then we got our condiments and stuff. I got a chocolate milkshake. Yeah, this is yours. And then he's got the drink. Can you put the straw over there? And Beck already ate their fries. Let's eat. Somebody's stealing my cheese fries. Mm -hmm. Because he just got the regular one. <laughs> I get the yummy cheese fries. And look at Beck. Enjoying it. Burgers. Ooh. I'm stealing my fries. Oh, that cheese is dry too, so that's good. You're on. but why is it white? Does it taste like chocolate? It's like ice cream. Oh my god, it's just bad in me right there. Let me try it. Yeah. <laughs> she don't want it? What? Oh, she's still so chewing her food. Better. Wow. See?